This is a story of unwavering determination and the pursuit of a dream that captured a nation's heart. Consider this. The legendary Sachin Tendulkar leads the Indian cricket team on the verge of greatness. They had an unshakable belief, a burning desire to lift the coveted World Cup. It was more than just a game. It was destiny knocking at their door. As they say, every story has its turning point. And this one was no different. The World Cup final was not just in a city of dreams. It was where dreams came true. Twelve years may have passed, but the magic of that day still lingers. The cricketing gods had a plan, and the stage was set in Sachin's Karma Bhumi. In the world of sports, unpredictability reigns supreme, and the 2011 World Cup was the ultimate reality TV show, filled with suspense, twists, and turns. Join us on this exhilarating journey as we relive the moments, the heroes, and the incredible triumph that etched its place in cricketing history. This is the story of India's World Cup glory, and you will want to attend every chapter. So, on the morning of that epic game, there was an undeniable excitement in the air. But here's where the story gets truly captivating. Can you believe the first person I met that day was none other than Kumar Sangakkara, the Sri Lankan captain? Not a word of best of luck was exchanged. Tension was building. Dean Jones, the late great Dean Jones, was there too, with his bullish belief in India's victory. Every time he expressed his confidence, the crowd erupted in cheers. In those moments, it wasn't just about covering cricket. We all wanted India to win. For many of us, we had grown up listening to tales of India's 1983 World Cup win. It was the stuff of legends. But on April 2nd, 2011, we were on the verge of experiencing history firsthand. It was no longer about being a fan. It was about becoming a part of cricketing folklore. A significant change in attitude marked the journey from the 2007 World Cup debacle to the 2011 triumph. The team management, led by Gary Kirsten, created an environment of trust and support. Gone were the days of mistrust and instability. The team was playing for each other, and that made all the difference. Just months before the World Cup, we saw the legendary Tendulkar send his cherished bat to Jalandhar for a last-minute repair. That very bat was destined to create history. The stage was set in 2007, but our journey was cut short. The pain of an early exit lingered, but in 2011, we believed it was our time to shine. There were whispers that Sashin might bid farewell to the white ball, feeling that the World Cup was a distant dream. But our belief was unwavering. Every player in the team gave their all, never skipping a practice session. They were a tightly knit unit, with their eyes firmly on the prize. The belief that they could lift the cup was their driving force, an idea that resonated with millions of fans. Three years of preparation led to that unforgettable World Cup victory. It was a team effort, with everyone making critical contributions at the right moments. The unity, the passion, the fire in their eyes. It was undeniable. But make no mistake, the pressure was relentless, playing at home with the world watching and a nation's hopes on their shoulders. From the hotel staff to the bus driver, everyone felt the intensity. Handling that pressure was the true test of champions. At the heart of this epic tale was the man of the moment, Yuvraj Singh. In a bold move, he approached Captain Dhoni, demanding the ball. Dhoni, known for his cool and collected demeanor, didn't hesitate to entrust Yuvraj with it. Yuvraj was a man possessed during that World Cup, and he was about to unleash his magic. India has seen its fair share of cricketing legends, but there may never be another Yuvraj Singh. His performance during that World Cup was nothing short of extraordinary. It was as if fate had written the script, and we were all mere spectators eagerly awaiting the next scene. As the match unfolded, deja vu set in for many. 
Memories of the Past of Sabina Park in Jamaica, the 2007 showdown between New Zealand and Sri Lanka all came rushing back. It was as if history was repeating itself, and India had a date with destiny. The last 10 overs belonged to the Indians, as they piled on almost 90 runs. But statistics had a different story to tell. No host had ever won a World Cup before, and a century in a World Cup final had always led to victory. The pressure was mounting. The question on everyone's mind was, were the Indians choking under pressure? In those tense moments, we held our breaths and said a little prayer. Deep inside, we knew it would take a lot to secure that ultimate moment of glory. Then it happened. Mahendra Singh Dhoni stepped up and hit that unforgettable six. It was a moment etched in history, one of the best moments of our lives. The entire nation erupted in jubilation. The champion of India, the beloved Mumbai boy Sachin Tendulkar, strides to the crease. The crowd's roar is loud, but in an instant, there's a hush. Pin drop silence engulfs the stadium as Malinga dismisses the legend. The collective gasps and heavy hearts broke the silence. For a moment, it seemed like India's dream was slipping away. Nervous anxiety gripped the nation. But cricket is a game of uncertainties. And as Sachin walked back, the journey took an unexpected twist. Enter Gautam Gambhir and Virat Kohli, who stitched together a vital 83-run partnership. Their cautious yet composed batting laid the foundation for India's chase of 275, bringing the game back to life. Then came the pivotal moment when Virat Kohli departed, replaced by the captain himself, Mississippi Dhoni. It was a surprise move, as Yuvraj Singh had been the standout performer throughout the tournament. The question echoed, why Dhoni? Dhoni's entry was the turning point, calming the nerves and exuding confidence. A man of ice-cool composure, Dhoni took charge. In the final overs, the world watched as he struck that iconic six with a helicopter shot, sealing India's World Cup glory. That thunderous six sent fans into wild celebrations on the streets of Mumbai. And it's a moment etched in the memories of every cricket lover. Even the TV coverage couldn't capture it all, as cameras failed in the studio. The unforgettable moment was only minutes away. Amidst the overwhelming emotions, a smile broke out on the face of one man, M.S. Dhoni. India's captain. But what happened off camera was even more profound. Dhoni was welcomed to the elite club of World Cup winning Indian captains, and then he broke down into tears. It was a moment that etched itself in the hearts of millions, including the commentator. The celebrations that followed were unlike anything ever seen. The Wankade Stadium was just the beginning. As India clinched the World Cup, Mumbai came alive like never before. The city that had witnessed political turmoil and despair suddenly found itself swept up in an unparalleled wave of joy. 2011 was a year filled with corruption, scandals, and gloom. But cricket has a unique power. It's a great equalizer, a unifier, and a source of hope. During those moments, Cricket became the beacon of light that lifted our spirits, reminding us of the strength of unity and the magic of the game. The 1983 cricket team carried the weight of being the only World Cup winning team for 28 years. And then a momentous change occurred. The visual of Kapil Dev shedding tears while watching another captain lift the World Cup after 28 years was truly heart-wrenching. Even Kapil Dev never expected someone would break his record. When Dhoni said, I was feeling alone and welcomed Kapil Dev, it was a true reflection of the cricketing fraternity's emotions. The biggest shock came the next day when M.S. Dhoni walked in bald. It turned out he had shaved his head with newspapers spread on his bed the previous night. The calm and collected demeanor of Dhoni during the final moments of the 2011 World Cup was nothing short of miraculous. He kept the faith even when India lost wickets, proving that sometimes miracles do happen. On the 2nd of April 2011, India achieved the impossible. The nation rejoiced as MS Dhoni's team lifted the World Cup. This was a moment that will be cherished forever. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into the story behind this incredible victory.
There's so much more to this journey, and we promise you won't want to miss it. Subscribe and hit that notification bell so you're the first to know what's next in our series about India's historic World Cup win.